video it's Armand again and we are at Red Rock Canyon um, visitor well the visitor centers behind me and we're here on uh, I'm gonna take the scenic loop drive um, the entrance is $15 normally but since we didn't have a reservation they charged two extra dollars so from October 1st of 2021 until I think May uh, reservations are re normally required. They let us through, but you have to pay two extra dollars. I think it's just uh, their way of getting some more funds, but that's just me. But in any case, uh, somewhere here, um, I'll show you around at the visitor center, and then I, uh, I'll kind of give you a glimpse of what to expect here at Red Rock. So you can see the the surroundings oh no in the parking lot but uh, over here be on this side and I don't know how clear it is on my camera but it is pretty amazing I love the scenery here so plenty of picture spots that you can take you know you're into this kind of thing which if you're watching my video you're probably into more nature stuff because I love this kind of stuff but uh, yeah here we are and uh, I'll take you in with me as we go into the visitor center and let's see what they have to offer as we approach the visitor center here at Red Rock let's see Native foliage. The visitor center closes at four thirty in the afternoon. different wildlife you can find out here. Golden Eagle, Great Horn Owl. Beautiful vantage point of all the, the whole canyon over here. Quite the view from this visitor center. Yeah, that can turn the dust go across and form sand dunes here and the Christian style. They were really high. Yes, they were really good. Yeah, they were beautiful. But don't forget, this was the edge of the park. When you go through the visit center to the other side, through the um, center itself, on the other side you have another view of the canyon here beautiful area that you can see the whole front of the canyon beautiful beautiful scenery the step back it has some placards of information of the different formations and the different types of rock birth of the landscape tells a little history of how it how it is oh. 
Hi guys, it's me again. Um, it's, it's me, Rose B. <laughs> That's my name, but it's me, Rose, Arman's wife. Charut. But yeah, um, we're here in Red Rock Canyon, and we're gonna go to the main. Um, what do you scenic call that? Drive. Yeah, we're gonna go to the main scenic drive. So here we go guys. I'm gonna show it to you So here we go, that's a mountain right there Look at the mountain Amazing I see God, no? Amazing God is so amazing and wonderful up close well semi up close off in the distance you can see some people hiking a lot closer to the canyon down here and you can get a, a good view so so pretty just amazing the natural beauty you see here it is windy so be prepared for that Awesome. Here's another stop along the scenic drive. This is kind of the backside of the Calico Hills. But what caught our attention is the people that are actually mountain climbing up up there and have their, their we saw some people way up there. Oh actually I don't know if you could see it from my camera, but they're way up there. Add some talent to to get up there. It's crazy. It's crazy. But down here, I have more scenic wonders. You can see. Pretty amazing. And this is the I think the second stop or the third stop. And each each area has a parking designated parking area so you can take pictures. Really love this area. And part way through the Scenic Drive, you have this view from the other side of the Calico Hills and the Calico Tanks and all the funny names that they have this area. It's just a very majestic view of the canyon and the, the whole area. It's really beautiful. There's, again, there's parking spaces that you pull off to the 
side. You see the whole area from here, it is so amazing. Really beautiful. So pretty. I love it. And remember, it's a one way thing, so stop to take the pictures while you can, or otherwise, you have to loop around the whole thing again, or just come back next time.